Hey, welcome back Design Squad and welcome to another Design Tool Tuesday. And in this week's Design Tool Tuesday, I'm gonna give a tool for UX copywriters. Some product designers or UX researchers, UX designers who let's say work with different updates for, you know, let's say text and things of that nature. And let's say if you're an established customer facing company, this is gonna be a life saving plugin because you need to maintain your copy and you need to know exactly what happens when, and perhaps you even have a copywriting or marketing team for customer experience who care about these things. And so let me demonstrate exactly what the plugin does first, and then you can make a decision if you want to explore, but it's a recent discovery and it seems pretty damn awesome from what I've seen so far and how I used it so far. This was designed by Chidinma. I probably am butchering your name, but it's one of the mockups, basically a template mockups, which you can download for free already. So just Google if you want this mockup. But the plugin itself is called Ditto. And let me just open a plugin and show you how it works. So if I launch it, as you can see, it opens in a panel. All I need to do is just literally copy the Figma resource, connect it, it does import, I can click continue, and then it syncs all that information, all that copy is going to open an app and boom, it immediately captured all that copy from my Figma file. And if I go back to my design, let's just let's just compare the things. As you can see here, I have that time frame, timestamp, I have headlines, I have some body text, and then I have a call to action text. And if I go to Ditto, as you can see, all of it has been captured. So I guess improve the body balance is definitely a headline. Same is for stop wishing to get fit, relieve stress from yoga, stuff like that. But now imagine that I'm, a, I'm, I'm actually a UX copywriter who wants to maintain these bits. This is where our magic comes. So say instead of improve your balance, maybe we are doing something like, hey, that copy doesn't convert. So do something like balance yourself in or something along those lines. And then I'm gonna add also a tag for let's say campaign and also maybe 2020. And so you can tag your changes as you do the UX copy based on let's say your user testing or hypotheses. And I can also go and do it, let's say in work in progress, in review, final. It it's really depends how you work with your team of copywriters. As I'm alone here, for example, in this specific scenario, I'm just gonna go to final, just save the edits boom, it automatically indicates that it's saved, I can resync it to Figma. Let's see what happens there. And I would open a ditto plugin again. As you can see, it's synced automatically an update, and I can literally boom, override it immediately. And it's done. Imagine if that's all I needed to do, I can just do that. But the best bit is really the actual data platform because that syncing is very neat. You know, imagine you can see the history of the changes, you can add notes, you can add tags. And imagine if you have 20 mockups, you might have hundreds of text entries. And you know, back in the day, this has been handled by let's say business analysts doing editorial stuff in Excel spreadsheets. If you would maintain some sort of enterprise system, and you need to keep on track of the changes and keep on requirements and doing all that waterfall bit, you would use Excel. Now these days, UX copywriters have tools like this, which is basically allows you to dynamically sync it, dynamically update it, you can then be nimble and adapt to what exactly the business needs to portray itself like, market it well and engage with the user. Now next, what I want to showcase, because you know, you might think, oh, it's very simple, I can just do it immediately mockups, so sure you can. But what's the best bit is that you can actually search for things. So you can, for example, as you can see, I have a few searches, I have a few tags defined, let's say just 2020. So I can check everything in it. As you can see, I had a test subject before, uh, I can check the campaign and tag it, it becomes like a UX copy manager for your Figma designs. It's pretty damn neat. So give this tool a go. As per usual, most of this is free. You can find it at dittowards.com as well as Figma plugin director install it immediately. We're not affiliated with this tool, it's just a great tool. Another Design Tuesday wrap up and I hope it's actually useful. And if so, give a like, subscribe to this channel, stay tuned for our next week and the next design tool which should improve your workflow in one way or another. So until next time.